Hey everyone, this is Sean and today I am going to review the DaVinci Junior Pro, okay? Now, if you've been following my channel for a while, you may have remembered a while back I did a video on the DaVinci Junior that wasn't a pro device, it was actually it looked almost exactly the same and there are several really fun improvements of this 3D printer over the original DaVinci Junior. So I was actually one of the beta testers for this 3D printer before it even came out on the market which was really cool and I have to say this is actually a huge improvement over the DaVinci Junior. I would say the biggest number one improvement is that you can actually use your own uh, third-party filament you don't have to use the XYZ printing uh, proprietary filament you can if you want to uh, the other massive improvement is that it has self leveling the print head will actually go down and it'll measure everything and make sure everything is perfectly level uh, which I think is awesome so you can see here this is an elephant uh, that I printed on this printer the level of detail on this elephant is way way better than the original da vinci junior so you can see here this was uh, uh printed um all the the joints can move um you know as you would expect from an elephant like this the quality this quality actually is comes very very close to what you would find on a high-end consumer printer so i was definitely very happy it's about six inches on each side which is actually a decent size but not as big as some of the printers that can do you know 10 to 12 inches uh, the other thing is that this uh, build plate is not heated I've come to love heated build plates for that you'll have to go up to the next model uh, but the heated build plate allows you typically allows plastic to, to stick really well to the surface because that's really the key with 3d printing is you want the first layer to stick perfectly and after that you've got a super high chance of a successful print so of course you can uh, you can print here with the SD card which is great I just love the way it looks. It looks like a desktop printer. It looks like something that you can have in your home or office that's not so hideous uh, in terms of things being out. And I know, I know some people really like that exposed uh, metal look that some of the more expensive printers have. And I've grown to like that as well, but I still definitely prefer this more consumer looking uh, 3d printer something that looks almost like a, a regular printer so there you go that was uh, my quick review of the da vinci junior pro feel free to go check out my video my other video on the original da vinci junior do stay tuned for more videos and thank you very much for watching